I wanted the teachers at the middle school to know about more about me. So 10 year old Annie Vichulis shared this presentation. It states she's 51 pounds and 3.7 feet tall. She's a little person and it's really not a big deal. We put in stools and we shorten desks and add shelves to the locker to make it more accessible for me. Once simple changes are made, Annie can navigate school like any other kid. She and her mom, Colleen, are sharing their story now to inform others during Dwarfism Awareness Month. I wanted them to know that uh, I'm very independent and I don't like to have people baby me. What we run into the most is being, is being babied, baby talked picked up by other students, things like that. She's an almost 11 year old and you wouldn't pick up another 11 year old. Annie was born with a rare genetic condition that's called spondyloepiphyseal dysplasia. It's a bone growth disorder that doesn't just affect the spine, it also affects the ends of the long bones in both the arms and the legs. I really thought when she was born that my reality was going to be I have to devote my life to helping this child through her life. It turned out to be exactly the opposite of what I thought it would be. She's a leader, an, a born natural leader. She's got a, you know, a lot of friends. People seem to gravitate to her. The Vichulises also want to raise awareness about PALS, patient airlift services, which offers free air transport for individuals requiring medical care. The family recently used the service to travel to Annie's yearly checkup with specialists down in Delaware. I got to sit in the co-pilot seat and I got to wear a headset. Okay, step away. While Annie may not grow much more, her mom says it doesn't matter. This mature girl who gets great grades hopes to someday become a vet and be her own boss. I am not concerned about her future at all. Uh, it really has zero to do with her height and and 100% to do with the size of her um, personality. I'm not different than anyone else. I'm just shorter in height and it's just a fact. I'm Tim Lammers, Fox 61 News.